negative 2x, yes? Mm -hmm. And when I distribute times this, a negative times a negative is a positive. positive. 12. My name is Tuet Hong, 12. and 12. I have been in crack for over two years, and I, I finished ESL, and now I attend for GED. In 1980, I escaped from Vietnam to Philippines with small boat. 230 people, seven days in the ocean without water and food. When I came to United States when I was 23, along with a husband, two children, and six younger brother and sister. In May 2011, my company outsourced, so I got laid off. I've been working there 23 years, and I got laid off. So I I. I'm looking for a job, but any job requires high school diploma. The clients that we serve under the Trade Act program at the Department of Labor frequently are in need of ELL classes. And for some of them, it's their first opportunity to go to work after many years of working in a, in a field. And they've never had the opportunity maybe to finish their GED, to finish, to develop their English to, to the point where they're successful seeking employment again. Building on the partnerships we have developed throughout the region, we are really proud to say that we have helped many adult students find their first job or a better job to help themselves and their families to leading a better life. To yet began here with us a few years ago through our English as a Second Language program. Because of how she had to flee her country, she was not able to bring her high school diploma with her. And so we put her in a GED class, and that's where she's now working on obtaining her GED. We've always said an education in one way or the other is worthwhile. Correct to get them going in as far as a GED and then other specialized programs, particularly in the computer area, or maybe it's going to be in writing or whatever the case may be, are excellent. ELL and GED are two of the many programs provided through community education. Our occupational skills training programs prepare students and help them find jobs. Tuyet is a wonderful example of a student who has gone through our programs and now is on to the next phase of her life successfully. Many people come here to be successful. They come to this country to live the American dream. And I think they're driven by that. They're driven by their children, by their family. And that is, in Tujet's case, uh, what drove her um, over 30 years ago when she came here. It was her young children and all of her siblings um, that she brought. We couldn't be happier. All of our staff rely on CREC to find quality training options. Education is the way. Education is the way. CREC is doing its job, the community colleges are doing its job, and the colleges are doing its job. It's now up to the student to do their jobs. It is never too late to go back to school. Never give up your dream or your goal. If I can make it, everyone, everyone I, I hope everyone can make it.